you get anything out of the forearm felon? No. But he's out of commission. I found some holding cells below. Guys, I scanned the whole base. There's no sign of any of the tech that Gorvin tricked us into stealing. At least Gorvin didn't have a chance to give that to the hybrid. Yeah, it's a good thing too. No telling what somebody could do with that if they were up to no good. Um... You guys mind telling me what exactly that is? It's called the sub-energy. It's a subatomic energy source. One of the most powerful in the galaxy. An alien race gave one to the plumbers years ago. It was stolen by an ex-plumber named Driscoll. Sounds like the plumber should have a better employee screening process. We thought that was the only sub-energy on Earth, but this can't be the same one. Ben destroyed that one. Well, wherever it came from, we need to make sure it doesn't get into the bad guy's hands. If you destroyed the last one, you can take care of this one, right? Oh, man. I was just starting to be able to eat spicy foods again. Your interference has forced me to deal with you, Vermin, directly, and obtain this energy source myself. No matter. When we have completed our objective, you and your entire genetically inferior race will no longer be in any position to meddle in the affairs of the hybrid. What did he mean by that? We better find out. Gwen, can you track him? Normally there'd be no way to do it, but the sub-energy is so powerful I should be able to find it if it's anywhere within a thousand miles. Oh no. Look at this. This is a satellite view not far outside Bellwood. A hybrid weather tower. No big deal. We've dealt with those before. Not one like this. Okay. That's bad. If one weather tower can freeze a whole town. An array like this one could freeze the entire coast. Maybe even half the country. We're responsible for this. We let Gorvin trick us into getting those components. And now, it's up to us to destroy that weather array. Thank <laughs> you.